Now find the inverse of these exponential functions, starting with question number three. I want the inverse, so I will switch x and y, and I want to solve for y. So I will log both sides of the equation, just because I want to bring the exponent down. So the y will come down and multiply log 2. That, of course, is just a log rule. So here we have log x equals, now I need to distribute the log 2, y times log 2, y log 2, and minus 1 times log 2, or negative 1 times log 2 is negative log 2. Great. Now I can add log 2 to both sides of the equation, both sides of the equation. And this is what we have so far. Now, since we're adding, I can just multiply the contents, right? So this will become x times 2, 2x equals y log 2. Then I can just divide both sides by log 2. Those will cancel out. And we get just y equals log 2x over 2 which I can actually change into log base 2 of 2x. And that is another log rule, the change of base rule. That becomes the base. That's it.